What's up, lady gang, 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 gang? It's your girl, lady, and I'm back with another banger. Okay, today's video is topic is a little mini smoke session. Plus, um, we're just I'm just gonna be talking about how I feel today, what this shirt represents, um, other YouTubers. I got a lot for y'all. So, and in the mix of that, I'm gonna be ordering me some food on the computer. I'm not sure if I go order on Grubhub through the computer, but we're gonna figure it out today. So, for starters. We got this rolled up. You know, I was smoking this one. I'm like, you know, it don't even feel right smoking this by myself. I got to tap into the young YouTube. Once again, I am home alone. Monday through Friday, I'm home alone. Until after about 3 o'clock, 4 o'clock. So... Get a couple of hits in and we're going to get it started. So basically, I'm going to start. I'm going to start by saying, talk about this shirt, what this shirt means to me and what it represents and who it is. So this right here, this is my best friend. This is, this is Tony. And me and Tony, we grew up together. We raised each other. We were best friends, you know, like that was my lover, my everything. And we met when we were tw when I was 12, he was 14, you know, so for seven years we were together, you know, every day, nonstop, no matter what. So like I said, that was my boyfriend, that was my other half, my everything, you know, and recently last year he got killed and when he got killed, it sent me through like this dark, dark depression is like I just hated the world I hated life I hated God I hated everyone like I didn't want to do anything like the only thing that kept me moving and keeps me moving till this day is my daughter my daughter I look at her and I'm like oh my gosh like I'd be crazy to give this up and leave her here alone you know so I'm just like she keeps me pushing but she's my best friend and today is the day he was actually put to rest you know from a year ago. He got killed August 26, 2019. And today, August, I mean, September 4th, would have been the day we laid him to rest. You know, we had a service and all that. So I don't know. I just woke up in a bad, not, I wouldn't say a bad mood, but just really emotional, just real sad. You know, like every day I sit and ask God and I ask myself, like, why did he leave me and why did he have to go? You know, but I just like, I know he's up there watching over me and he's watching over my, over my daughter and he got us and God got us, you know, and it took me a long time to actually get God back into my life and understand that everything happens for a reason. God don't make no mistakes, you know, so yeah, he's gone. Yeah, I hurt, but everything's for a reason. I may not know the reason now. I may not know it ever, but you know, it's for a reason, but yeah, that's just... I don't want to get too emotional because it's going to make me cry just thinking about it, but, um, yeah. So, um, I'm going to show you guys my journal when I come back. All right, guys, so, got my journals. This is Scorpio. I am a Scorpio. My daughter is a Scorpio. This is one of my journals I just recently got, you know, um, I'm not... I would show you guys what's in it, but I don't know. I'm just a real personal person, so I like to keep my stuff personal, but I've been drawing in this. I draw in here. I do my sketches. I do, like, um, little motivational quotes in here. I, I could read y'all a couple of my quotes. Well, they're not mine, but, you know, there's stuff, there are quotes that spoke to me. And, and one of them, the very first one, is whatever I go through, I get through. So even when I'm not good, I'm good. You know, and I and I that I really felt that that really spoke to me. So that's the very first page in my journal, you know, and I decorated, you know, made it look nice, you know, to where it speaks to me. Then there's another one. It's taking me a little longer because I'm doing it all by myself, but it's coming. You know, and I got some drawings in here, more quotes, you know. I like to draw cartoons. I'm a real cartoonish person, so like cartoons and stuff like that, I'll draw them out. And then I got this book. 
It was it yesterday? Yesterday I went to Walmart. Yeah, it was yesterday. Yesterday I went to Walmart and I went and got a bunch of arts stuff. Like, well, not even art stuff, like crafty stuff, like office supplies and notebooks. I got this notebook. I liked it. It's a, I, let me tell y'all. I should have recorded my Walmart trip yesterday because I originally went in there to only get seasonings because I made bitter tacos yesterday and yeah I came out with like 200 and some dollars worth of stuff but anyway yeah I was in the notebook section for like 20 minutes looking at all the notebooks I just wish I could have bought them all but I ended up deciding on this one and I got like a regular spiral um five subject notebook or whatever one subject I don't know but I just decorated it and basically this book is going to be my like craft journal like how i'm feeling you know with not much writing basically i have little to no writing in this book you know most of it will be pictures and cutouts so i'm still deciding what i want to call this book well there it is right there ideas i'm dead but it says who am i and it really basically just has a bunch of stickers and cutouts you know that explain me and what i like and what i'm about you know, and it's not finished yet, because like I said, I just started this yesterday, so, yeah. And then I also bought my daughter one. My daughter's two and a half. Well, she's almost not even two and a half, but here's a picture of my daughter. My little lovely baby. I'm going to uh, bedazzle this out and put a bunch of little love signs and hearts and stickers, you know, there to show what my daughter means to me and how she makes me feel. You know, this is that's what this book would just basically be about. You know how I feel, who I feel, you know, so yeah. But, um, what else is going on in my life? Oh, my daughter, okay, so she's only two years and 10 months. And her teacher tells me a few weeks ago that they want to move her to ECE. Anybody knows that a two-year-old, three-year-old, you're soon to be three-year-old, is not an ECE, you know? So I'm, like, stoked. Like, I'm I'm beyond, like, happy. Like, I'm proud of my daughter. Like, cause she goes to daycare now, but she goes to daycare from nine to four, you know? For, well, her, it's, well, I pick her up at 3.30, but they say get them at four, so 3.30. But, yeah. And I'm just so happy, like, she's so smart, she knows her ABCs, her one, two, three, she knows how to count, she knows baby showers, she knows mommy fingers, she's so smart. Like, my daughter, she tells me, like, amazing, and that's beautiful, like, she knows big words for her age, you know, so, and everything she does is just like, oh my god. Y'all better be lucky I'm getting high, because I be ramp, but, ramp, but, ramp, but, ramp, but. I have no idea why my nose is like running, but yeah. I think I'm gonna do a couple mukbangs on here. How you say mukbang? 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 Yeah. I like mukbang. Mukbang. I don't know. I'm gonna do some of those though. And I'm going to let my daughter join me in. Watch, wait, I'm going to do a seafood. Well, watch till y'all see how my daughter is with the seafood. Like, this is ridiculous. Like, but I don't know. I, I ain't even going to lie. I was down before coming on this video today. So, only thanks to YouTube. I don't have many viewers. But, you know, hit that like. Hit that subscribe. Hit that la, 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 like button. Hit that sub subscribe button before I can find you in <laughs> you know I guess we just smoked the rest of this blood oh if y'all Netflixers cause I've been trying to watch new shows cause P-Valley you know P-Valley been playing with our emotions lately so I watched this TV show on Netflix called Imposters I ain't gonna ruin it too much, but it's basically about this girl who hops state to state, marrying men and women, stealing all their money, you know, and then going to do it all over again, and she finally gets caught up, and then the people find her, and it just gets juicy. Let me tell y'all, I watched, was it three seasons or two seasons? 
I think it was three seasons. But the episodes was long. I mean, there was like 19 episodes. You know, there was a lot of episodes and episodes was like 40 minutes. But I watched that in two days. That's when you know you watch you, you a juicy show. When you could just watch up a show in like that. That's how I watch Roots. Don't try to come for me. But I recently watched Roots for the first time. And I love it. Like I love Kunta I know my boyfriend and all my family and friends and me is tired of, talk, tired of hearing me talk about Kunta Kids A&M. But I love Kunta Kids A&M. You feel me? Because if you want to keep it real, if it was back in the day, that Kunta Kids would have been my nigga. Mm-hmm. It's like, we don't cut that out. Let's cut that out. Yeah. Because I ain't no George type of nigga. I'm sorry. I used to have me a George. This is the only George I would have. Y'all don't feel me, but if you watch Roots, you know what I'm talking about. If you feel me, oh, damn, look here, I get to go. <laughs> I know my thing sticking up. That's because I have this piece of hair that's supposed to be tucked right here. Look, this piece of hair. Supposed to be tucked with my bobby pin back there, but it's not. But there it goes. Alright, 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 a, a, a. Oh, let me show you this. Now, what is this? Oh, it's pancakes. This is the weed I'm smoking. Um, the weed I'm smoking is right here. Oh, spill my trees. Oh, and the but it's okay. And I got some little jars of these. I bought these jars from Walmart the other day. But I thought that was cute. You know, I'm a girl. I'm tired of having those big old black manly jars. So I thought these would be cute to keep my weed in and be like, yeah, I got me some trees. I don't know about y'all, but I got my weed, you feel me? Mm-hmm. And I got me some good sticks. And I got this. This is my backup emergency. This ain't even supposed to be in my bag, but I took it out because I thought I was going somewhere today, but I'm not going nowhere until later. So I might need it. I'm going to do a what's in my bag video, I think, next because... I got, okay, I got my backpack. My backpack is a little dirty, so I'm going to switch my bag. But it's a just do it, a yellow just do it bag, which, you know, I've been carrying it for like a few weeks because I've just been in this depression of state, not giving a fuck. And I just be like, throw it over there, throw it over here. I don't give a damn, it's over there. You feel me? So, yeah. And I'm about to do a baby haul giveaway. I'm gonna I'm gonna have y'all go. I'm gonna do a video also on the baby stuff we have here, brand new. So I'm gonna have you guys go through that with me, fold it up, you know. And I'm gonna do a diaper cake. I'm gonna learn how to do a diaper cake for my cousin. He recently he had a uh, he had a baby shower, and I didn't get the chance to make it. So for him, his his baby mama, his girlfriend, I loved him both. Missed Misty, you know what's up, baby. But yeah, they don't know. They'll never see this video. So I'm all good. But yeah, so after this, there's a couple more videos coming today. So don't miss them. Don't miss them. I'm going to load them back to back to back to back to back. So make sure you hit my, my, uh, my thumbs up, my like, my subscribe, my like, my subscribe. Because I'm going to have, I ain't going to call them bangers because they're just regular videos. But you know I'm going to have my weed in there so that makes it a banger automatically. I need to watch me some Mindy or something. And I'm just new to like these YouTube, so I'm learning. Like, y'all need to help me out. What 
what um apps and what stuff do y'all use to edit y'all's videos to put you know prompt y'all videos to give them the sound effects all of that cool you know boom bow boom you feel me so help me out help your girl out because i'm helping y'all out giving y'all videos to watch I really want to do a mukbang. I need some crab legs. I've been wanting. My daughter was telling me last night she wanted lobster. I made a beer of tacos. I mean, beer of tacos. And she said, Mom, I want lobster. I said, You want who? I want lobster, Mom. Well, we don't got lobster lyric. And she's like, Um, why not? Because I didn't buy none, so if you want lobster tomorrow, so I gotta go buy my baby some lobster today before she gets out of school. Because she's gonna be on me about her lobster. And the little blood is almost gone. We got about a couple more hits. And I'm like, in this, in this, in this, in this. I ain't been wearing all my jewelry. Like I said, I've been going through a real emotional state. And I'm not like most people, like, when I go through my depression and my anxiety, like, I, I'll fucking shave my head, fucking, I don't know, hide shit from myself and shit, you know. Eat up your whole house and home. No, no. But I feel better now. That's a good, that's a good thumbnail. And I need somebody to tell me how I... Take my thumbnail. All right, lady, gang, 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 gang. I'm into this. Boom.